Hey gang. Uh, <laughs> so I just recorded a video for you and then realized that I probably shouldn't post it. Um, got on my soapbox a little bit about rules, rule books, people asking questions about rules, and community. So I'm going to take a different tack because the other video came across more as a rant, uh, a selfish rant, than uh, the point I was trying to make. There are a lot of people online, I think, who uh, are genuinely uh, concerned and care about the community of uh, board war gamers and historical simulation games and all that fun stuff. And there are people who uh, want to make the the, you know, the community bigger and want to make it better and have more people play lots and lots of different types of games and that's all awesome and I'm I would like to think of myself as one of those people I I started doing videos and AARs because I enjoyed it for me it was a way for me to express my experience of the game and a lot of that had been taken the wrong way and you know I get a lot of negative feedback and comments on that and that's all good whatever you know at first I took it personally and then I realized that it, you didn't get it whoever you were or you didn't understand or you're just a hater and you know as they say haters got to hate right so uh, the so I like to I like to give so I see now as my you know gaming has evolved and what I do has evolved and my experimentation with presenting a game in a certain way or uh, uh, trying to write an AAR perhaps in the more traditional style or whatever the case may be I'm trying to do all sorts of different things with the medium of video imagery writing etc etc so I, I I'm trying to experiment and, exper and experience and it, some of those things connect with you and some don't and uh, one of the things that I had been, been doing for quite a while for the last two years was really trying to give back to all the people who'd helped me uh, and being helpful in the communities that I play games in and answering questions. And uh, I, I think after a while there becomes there's this fatigue that occurs in BGG and content world uh, that you know, you're answering the same question over and over. And uh, I think for a lot of people who selflessly do that, you know, the rule czars and the guys who are like the, the point men for various game systems and game topics, they do just an amazing job and I really need to kind of step out of that and let them do that and not jump in to answer that question immediately for someone because hey, half the time I get it wrong and I get yelled at by Mark Mitchell and by Vance and other guys, particularly in the local load forums because I'm wrong half the time because I, I kind of just play the game all the way I want to play it and, uh, uh, and sometimes I kind of bother picking a rule book up to look it up and so I'll spout off and say something's wrong um, so I need to stop doing that so I uh, I haven't been answering as many questions, and I think uh, I've also just not been on BGG, not been on quite a bit the last two weeks, but for the last month since I got my last ban for seven days, I've just said kind of the heck with it. I'm not, I'm not posting in here in, as a commentator and a participant in the community. I'm going to post my content, and that's about it. Um, lost my train of thought. So since I haven't been posting answers to questions, I've had a lot of BGG email, personal emails and some Consum World emails about games and topics and questions and one-on-one -on -one questions. And I started trying to answer those. And you know, I'm getting a lot, of, well, I think a fair amount of questions. And um, I don't think it helps the community if I do that one-on-one -on -one with you. Uh, anytime I play on Vassal uh, or to teach someone a game, which I do uh, on a fairly regular basis, and I'm always open to help pretty much anybody, as long as you're reasonable and not going to try and be a rules lawyer with me and co contradict every single thing I say. I've had that happen, particularly with Lock and Load or with World of War. So, you know, you're just being a jerk. So, work it out yourself. Um, but I'm more than happy to get on any time with anybody and play with you and show you the game and then you should better work it out because there's a ton of resources for all of these games. Musket and Pike has uh, great resources. OCS has a, has a great resources and a great community. Lock and Load, there are so many Lock and Load summaries and charts and tables and things to help you condense down what you need to know. Boom, you're done. You don't need to ask questions. You need to read the freaking rules. 
again and again. I know they're not well formatted sometimes, and I know they're chatty and all the rest of it, but they are what they are, all right? And if you're playing World at War and you're new to game, war games, they're, they're a good rule set. I've read much, much worse. And I, I think you, you just we all got to just take a step back and not have this <laughs> got to get an answer because I've got to play my freaking game. You know, just go try. And if it doesn't work out, then just keep going. Make it up. House rule it. Roll a die. If it's even, I'm going to do this. If it's odd, I'm going to do that. Anyway, we get back on the rant. Stop. So, uh, I'm posting this up to say, first of all, thank you to everybody uh, in the community who's helped me in the past. And I think that one of the great things about uh, me doing, uh, being involved in board gaming being involved in this, you know, idea of the big board, which you know has now got you know a few other players and rules, uh, lawyers and uh, writers and videographers and bloggers and stuff that are either joining, have joined, or uh, joining and are posting occasionally. That is awesome. I love the community that's being created uh, more on Facebook than anywhere else. You know, uh, Facebook uh, across the, the two or three different places that I post. You know, there's over nearly a, it's not quite a thousand, that would be an exaggeration, but there's nearly a thousand uh, people, and uh, probably 700 unique uh, names that all join in and participate, and it's really cool. And a lot of you are just consumers, you just want to consume, you know, whatever it is, I'll make it. Uh, whether you like it or not, you take a look at it, and I appreciate it, and that, that uh, uh, doesn't make me feel good or bad it inspires me just to go and keep going because I, I love I have so many games I want to play and I'm damn it I'm playing them and I'm going to get through them all and I want to get through them and, and, and have a rich experience with them that's why I write and make videos uh, so so uh, I guess my point so I, I, this is kind of kind of gone off the rails we are so far off the tracks now that it doesn't really matter uh, read the rules yourself Make, a, make an honest effort to work it out. Enjoy what people share with you. That's my dog. See, even he's aggravated with me. And uh, give back to the community. So once you've learned a game, there are a handful of you guys uh, in, in certain communities uh, that are just awesome. And I'm not going to name names because I want to embarrass you, but guys like Tyler and uh, Jonathan Holland, uh, two that I can think of, uh, and uh, 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 Judd, He's been around for a while, but he's given back to the community in such a big way with Empire of the Suns. It's just amazing. So I really appreciate all you guys. And so if you're a new gamer or you're an old crotchety gamer and you, you're sick of people asking questions, stop bitching and, and jump online and help out for a little bit. All right. And if uh, it's really easy for all of us to be negative online, and I'm the worst offender because I, I read stuff and go, what the, what the hell were you thinking? Uh, particularly if it's one o'clock in the morning and I've been playing and I'm tired or I've had a cocktail or whatever. So I'm trying to stop myself from doing that. I'm never going to be a real nice guy online, but I'm just going to be who I am. And uh, anyway, whatever. Just have fun with the friggin' games. Don't get spun up around the axle on the, on the stuff and enjoy yourself. Take a picture and post it. I'll put it on the big board and we'll all go, hoo hoo, you're awesome. And we'll love you. Have fun. Uh, peace. Talk to you soon. Where's the button? Hello, button.